Thank you for choosing the Future Cow Teat Scrubber to wash, disinfect, stimulate, and dry teats in one easy, consistent process. This video will show you how to properly use your teat scrubber to get the best possible results. We'll also show you some maintenance tips to keep your scrubbers working their best. Future Cow recommends setting up territorial prep zones when using teat scrubber in any parlor larger than a double 12. Each territory has its own milker and its own teat scrubber. Territorial milking will make the teat scrubbing process more efficient and allow you to clean and attach the milking units in the recommended 90 to 120 seconds. This time frame is ideal for proper milk letdown. If your routine begins with four strip, you have two options. You can four strip each cow first as they're lining up in the parlor before using the teat scrubber. A second option is four strip and scrub each cow one at a time. After four stripping, you will use the teat scrubber to prep the cow's teats. It should take between six to 10 seconds per cow to complete the pre-milking process. In that time, each teat will be washed, dried, disinfected, and stimulated. To start the wash cycle, press and hold down the trigger. This will start the brushes spinning and start the flow of disinfectant. Start with the teat in the front left side of the udder. Use the scrubber to clean the teat in a soft back and forth motion. Wash the teat until all visible soil is removed. Then move in a clockwise direction and scrub all four teats completely. You should always finish with the teat closest to you to avoid cross-contamination. It is very important to keep the trigger pressed during the entire wash cycle. Once you have cleaned all four teats, release the trigger to start the dry cycle. When you release the trigger, the brushes will keep spinning, but the solution will stop flowing. Dry the front left teat first, then use the same clockwise motion as before until all four teats are dry. The dry cycle is very short until there are no visible drips. It is okay if the teat has a small amount of moisture left on it. The teat will be dry before you attach the milking unit. Now repeat the wash and dry process down the line for all the cows in your territory. Once you're finished prepping your last cow, go back to cow number one and start attaching the milking units. After each line of cows, you should clean the scrubber by pulling and holding the trigger. While the brushes are spinning, spray down the top of the handle unit thoroughly and inside the brush chamber. This will help remove any material that may have been left in the unit. Once the cow is done milking, be sure to post dip immediately to help prevent mastitis. If a teat scrubber needs to be switched out during your shift, simply disconnect the plug from the side of the protective green future cow bag. Flip open the latch and pull gently to disconnect the plug. Next, remove the external tubing by pushing the tubing in toward the plastic fitting while simultaneously pushing down on the outer ring of that fitting. Now you can remove the scrubber and replace it with a new one. Be sure to hang the new teat scrubber securely before connecting to the cable. Now reattach the external tubing and pull the trigger to make sure the brushes rotate and the solution flows properly. Teat scrubbers are designed to require no maintenance besides brush changes. You should change brushes approximately every 10,000 cows milked. To change brushes, begin by pulling the three tabs to remove the brush cover. Now grasp two of the three brushes with one hand to lock the gears in place. This will allow you to unscrew the third brush with your other hand. Be sure to not fully remove the brush so that you can repeat this process to loosen all three brushes. Now that they are loose, all three brushes can easily be removed. When you replace the top two brushes, be sure to match the black core brush with the black gear and the white core brush with the white gear. Finally, replace the larger teat end brush into the bottom gear. Make sure the brushes are screwed in tightly before putting the brush cover back on. Now your teat scrubber is ready to continue working. Using the Future Cow Teat Scrubber is the best way to prep your cows. And when you follow the proper routine, you will see faster milking times, healthier teats, and better milk quality.